good midday to you to you all. Uh, Cameron Stewart calling in uh, from the Southern Motorway, heading uh, towards Manukau in Auckland City, New Zealand. Absolute cracker of a day here. Um, what I wanted to have a chat about today, um, which is something that is very, very important, and uh, this subject is to understand that the winning ticket in life is actually you. The winning ticket in life is actually you. You know, it doesn't matter what course you take, what books you read, what coaches you have, those people and those courses and all those things can lead you in the right direction, but at the end of the day, if you don't make a decision and really put some hard work into place on yourself, the chances of your uh, your success will be very slim. G'day Ricky, how are you Mark? So, I just want you to understand, to, to get your success or get your momentum in life in whatever field it is that, that you're heading towards doing, you've got to understand that you are the winning ticket. You've got to understand when you look in the mirror that you are the you are you are a success. You just haven't taken the action yet, but you have the you have the ability within you to go and do whatever it is that you want to do. The problem is with most people, and it, it all links in together. All of these different subjects that I talk about all link in together. But at the end of the day, if you don't like what's looking at you in the mirror, then you've got to work on that. Because at the end of the day, we can point the finger and we can blame others and we can blame the government and all this other stuff. But at the end of the day, if you don't work on yourself and you don't grow and develop yourself, and if you don't take action within yourself, you'll never gather any momentum. So understand, look, everyone on this earth is unique. We're all different. We've all got different skills. We've all got different abilities. We've all got... Um, different personalities we've got all we, we can all relate to a different group of people so understand that you are the winning ticket what you see when you look in the mirror is the winning ticket buying a lotto ticket is not the winning ticket see the thing is a lot of people that go and win big lotto prizes and things like that is they get the money and then they blow it anyway because they don't know how to manage money. They don't know how to deal with that amount of money coming to the account because they've never been conditioned to that. So hence why a lot of people that win a lot or whatever, they actually lose all the money again. It's because they haven't figured it out that they actually they are the winning ticket in their own life. So whoever you are, wherever you are watching this around the world or around New Zealand, around Australia, understand that you are the winning ticket. You have the ability to do whatever it is that you want to do. She's a, a weak connection. It's always buddy a bit rough along here. I'm just uh, coming along by... Uh... Can you still hear me there? G'day Sarah, how are you? Um, well, hopefully that didn't cut out too much. It just goes a bit funny along this stretch of the road. So, look, I, I'm not going to go on too much about it, but understand, ladies and gentlemen, that when you look in the mirror, that person looking back at you is your winning ticket in life. It's not up to anyone else. It's up to you. You know, it's like... Um, I could have kept watching all these people doing these um, messages or videos and all this stuff online and kept watching keep watching, keep watching, learn heaps of stuff, learn heaps of stuff, but until I actually took action, until I actually took action, I wasn't going to get any result, you know, since I started this uh, this whole online videos thing, I've, I've done it consistently every day, one to two videos every day, but I, it's because I understand that it's up to me to make it work, see most of you out there, or a lot of people out there, you, 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 your five minute wonders you do something for five minutes and then you stop so you un understand if you want to win or you want to create your own success you've just got to be consistent you don't have to do any great feat 
you just got to be consistent on a daily basis, day in, day out, day in, day out, day in, day out. And I see this a lot with a lot of people I do accountability stuff with, is a lot of people just don't stick with it. Hence, they don't get any result. The thing is, you've got to stick with it. If you're going to make a decision, and you're going to look at that person in the mirror and go, I'm valuable, I'm going to make my own, I'm going to, I'm going to create my own destiny, I'm going to create my own success, you've just got to become consistent. You don't have to do anything more than that. You've just got to come can't become consistent in the basic fundamentals of a success. You know, look, I've been doing some accountability stuff with um, Lee Bundy from Team Beast Mode and uh, doing it a little bit differently than what I always did. Like, get, geez, they've got me getting up at five in the morning, you know? Getting up at bloody five o'clock every morning, you know, that's tough when you don't have to get up. See, I don't have to get up, guys. This is what I don't understand. What I don't understand with people is... They've got the winning ticket. They've got that person in the mirror looking back at them, but they don't ever take any action. Why is it that the people that are more successful in life, that have more runs on the board, have more money, more time, why is it that they're more motivated than the people that have no money and no time? Because when they look in the mirror, they see that person looking back at them and they go, that guy or that girl, they know that that person's special, that they can go out there and they can make success happen. And that's why I thought I'd talk about this subject. I'm, I'm just heading up to a meeting, so I'm going to have to get off this uh, in a second. But understand, you've just got to back yourself, guys. Uh, like, I remember there was a point in time where I felt extremely uncomfortable wearing a suit. Well, I, spe- I felt extremely uncomfortable standing up in front of people. But I always understood that the fundamentals of creating your success, you had to push through those fears, you had to push through those boundaries. But to push through those fears and push through those boundaries, you had to have enough self-worth when you look back in the mirror. So understand, this subject is about you. It's about you. What is it that you want to do? It's not about me. That's not why I started doing these videos. I don't put all these videos out on a daily basis because I love going on video live. I do it because I want to help people. I want to help people step up. If you don't know how to do it, reach out and ask for help. If, you, if you're afraid of the next step, reach out, ask for help. If you don't know um, how to get your self-worth up, to, to get your self-belief up, reach out, ask for help. But the thing is, most of us are just going to keep poking life with a stick, okay? And these videos are not in, intended for people that are comfortable and content in life. They are for the people that want to move forward, that want to do something different. And that's why I do this stuff. I do it because I, and I know it works because I've got so many people, I've had so many people from all around the world messaging me, you know, and even close friends of mine, you know, have said, you know, like, it's actually really cool what you're doing, and even people that I never thought would have even watched these videos are watching them, but I'm not intending it to make someone feel inferior, that's not what it's about, it's about helping you realise that you are the winning ticket, whatever it is that you want to achieve, you can achieve, you know. It is whatever the mind can conceive, it can achieve. You know, you hear that saying over and over again, but you doubt it. When you don't don't like what you see in the mirror, you doubt all of that stuff, your self-belief shit, all this other stuff. See, there's so many people that are way more smarter, way more smarter than me and other people that I know that are really successful. They're a lot more smarter on paper. They're well-educated. They come from um, good families where they've had financial abundance. They've got all this stuff, but they don't have any self-worth. So that when you've got no self-worth and you don't understand that you are the winning ticket, it just goes into a downhill spiral, and that's why most people never progress. So understand, um, ladies and gentlemen, that if you want to progress, you need to really love what you're looking at when you see in the mirror. It doesn't mean you have to like what you look like. It doesn't mean I look at myself in the mirror every day and, you know, look at myself and go, that guy, look at that guy, because to be honest with you, my physique's not that great, so I can't look at it for too long. So understand, but that's something I've got to work on, okay? So ladies and gentlemen, if you want to progress with your life, understand that you are the winning ticket. You are, you do have the key to your success, and it's the person that's sitting here watching this video. It's the person that looks in the mirror every day. 
So understand that you have the ability to be great. You have the ability to step it up to the next level. You have the ability to set up any business or any um, any or create anything that you want in life. It, 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 it's just a decision, guys. It's just a decision. So I've got to get going. I'm, I'm just heading into a meeting now. So thanks for listening. It's 12.30 here, uh, Auckland time. The sun's shining. Um, I think it's about the 6th of December today, so we're getting close to the end of the year. Now's the time to run. Now is the time to run. Don't wait until the new year. Time to step it up, make some decisions, and we'll see you at the top. Thanks for listening. Please like and share my page, uh, Cameron Stewart. I think it's um, CJ, capital C, Cameron, 1984. So if you share my page, like my page, go into the YouTube channel. There's a heap of messages on there that can help people um, get some ideas around um, success and, and, and steps and processes and things like that. So have a great day and we'll talk to you soon. See ya.